Welcome to this tutorial brought to you by River City Graphics. Today I'm going to be showing you some of the new content aware features that have been brought to the patch tool in Photoshop CS6. So to get started we're going to open up Photoshop. Now the way that the content aware feature worked in Photoshop CS5 um, was basically that you would grab any kind of selection tool. In my case I'm just going to grab the lasso tool and select out something that you want Photoshop to fill in. In this case this tree. Then you go up to edit then down to fill and click OK with content aware selected. Photoshop would run through the area that you selected, figure out what you wanted it to be instead of that tree, and it would use its magic in order to uh, instantly fill that area in. So pretty cool. Now there are some issues with this tool. Now if we were to back it out to where we would have just the tree there, make a selection, say that we wanted to go down further and grab some of these power lines and things like that um, closer up to the house and also the tree. Then we do the same thing, edit fill click OK. It's going to run through that and we're going to see that we're going to have a little bit of a problem because it's so close to the house that Photoshop thinks that part of the house is what we wanted in that area. Now we can fix this by actually taking the patch tool and with the new content aware features within the patch tool basically you would select the content aware up here instead of normal under patch and then under adaptation I just leave it on medium but if you're having some issues you can make it um, change your selection more strictly or loosely depending on what you need. So then it basically works just like the patch tool does. You just grab the selection, drag it over here, and I'm just going to put it right here. Now you can see that it's off of um, the area. I'm not actually getting the complete area if you look on the left there. Um, but if I release, it's going to still be able to figure out exactly what I want and do a pretty nice job of filling that entire area in. Now you can see that the content aware by itself didn't work very well, but actually using that patch tool with the new content aware feature um, gave us a much nicer result. So I hope you guys learned something in this tutorial. I hope you um, try out Photoshop CS6. You can get the beta in, as a free download in the link in the description. So I hope you guys learned something. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment, and check back next week for a new video tutorial. Thanks for watching.